All right, here we go. It's Unbox Things with Michael and Andrew and Bunsen and Jinx again. Today we are looking at the Nerd Block for May 2015. Oh, they already tried to steal something out of it. Oh, you bastards. Do you remember what the theme was for this one? Uh, no clue. I don't remember either. Was was it Heroes or something? But because they're shipping it from a U.S. Oh. place now. Yeah, let's look at this. We can actually look at the label without being told exactly what's in it. Yeah, because we used to be getting these things from Canada. <laughs> and when we got these things from Canada, they would actually have to tell us what was inside our For customs. Box. For customs purposes. Dirty customs. So we would sit there and it was a little um, little unnerving because we wanted to be surprised. And unfortunately, we weren't surprised because we could see exactly what was going to be inside it. Alright, so let's see. The website says... Uh, I don't know. <laughs> it's probably moved on, hasn't it? Yeah, I think so. Um, hmm... Well, yeah, well, we'll figure it out. It'll be an extra surprise. Be an extra surprise. So, here we go. Hold on one second, hold on one second, hold on one second. Let me put my key away. And, we apologize in advance if you get any big dog heads in this video because my dogs are just hanging out right here watching us. Yeah, I think they'll be fine. Yeah, they'll be fine. Alright. Is that a 555 or a 666 address? Wow, is that Nerdblock 666 Riverwalk Parkway? Or is it just a bad printed 555? Uh, well there's a 20165. That's uh, your zip code? Yeah, that's my zip code, but you can see the 6 and the 5. I think it's 555. Alright, let's hope it's 555. <laughs> Alright, so, do we want to get the t-shirt out of the way? Yeah, do the shirt first. Hey, <clears throat> this month's t-shirt. Wow. <laughs> okay. This month's t-shirt is a Gundam shirt. So if you're into giant robots, this is a cool shirt. I actually you're getting all want... sorts of shirts for yourself. I know. I'm getting <laughs> lots of really bad Japanese type shirts. <laughs> but I love this. This is I mean one big Gundam head. How could you not love it? Which one is it? Shirt punch. Save 10%. Okay. I I like this one. Let me see. Uh, okay. And oh my gosh, we've never gotten these before. Oh. Buttons! Buttons! Yes! Buttons! Oh, wait, wait. Okay. <laughs> I have a friend that's going to love this. If you can see this, uh, we'll have close up pictures of it uh, on our website, unboxings.com. Uh, but these are My Neighbor Totoro buttons. So, uh, there's going to be a certain segment that's going to fall in love with these buttons and we'll put them on their denim jackets as they sing Debbie Gibson songs. I I think this is a box catered for Michael. <laughs> so, we'll go we'll, we'll cut to the chase to get him something good. Oh, a manga. Ooh, Evangelion. Nice. Ooh, okay, there you go. You get yourself a manga. Neon Genesis. So you get to read an Eva manga. This should be good. Have you not read it yet? Oh, I've read it. Ah. I've read it. I've seen every incarnation of the cartoon. Okay. All right. Woo! Now you get yourself a convertible bandana multifunctional headwear. I get a bandana! A bunch of anime Jeff <gasps> stuff. Oh! Okay. <laughs> I, told, I told you this is pretty much... So if you if you watch Michael if you Fox. watch any of our stuff, you'll see that, that Andrew is a Marvel comics guy. Um, Brian is into zombies and stuff, and I am the the anime manga guy. So what you've got is a convertible bandana, but as you look at it, it says multifunctional headwear, and it has all these instructions on how you put it together and how you can wear it. But the reason I get all jazzed for this, and okay, I'm a middle aged dude, but I might wear this. <laughs> Shut the hell up. You turn it around, and it got me excited because you see on the back are Cowboy Bebop characters. 
So, I know. Oh, I've heard of it. Yeah. In the United States, it was a very big cartoon. In Japan, it was it was an okay cartoon. For some reason, the Americans got really hopped up over it. But, you know, I, I saw this picture of Faye Valentine. I was like, ooh. So, all right. Yeah, I got a bandana. There you go. Nah. Oh, we're at the Awesome Con. Ooh. A bag of some sort. For okay. But you'll probably know what it is. This. All right. This is a uh, shoulder sack. So yeah, but you know. I figured. But this is the insignia of what you call it. Uh, the the fighting core from Attack on Titan. So there's another segment of of collectors and anime manga readers. Um, and anime watchers that are going to love this. <laughs> we should just wear all the geeky stuff we got and go to the awesome con with it all. <laughs> oh, that, I'm going to wear all the stuff all at the same time. Yeah, gonna, oh, exactly. No, no, no. I'm going to go I'm gonna go into a bar and go, hey, ladies. Huh. What's up? Anime. Yeah. What else we got? Postcards. Uh, got what postcards. did you think of this nerd blocks? We'd like to know. My guilty nerd pleasure is... Eh, it's a feedback card. Okay, that's nice. Everybody needs a feedback nice. card. Nice. And... Remember to show the camera. Related, I'll share. Wait, what was that? No, the, uh, I'm just going to give away this. That's okay. Oh, okay, go ahead and do that. So, it's a Funko Pop! Yes, of Dragon Ball Z. Dragon Ball Z. It's a perfect sell. So... Ooh. No. Huh? I was looking at it... This way, I do not believe it's an actual bobblehead one. Uh, that's okay. I, no, I'm okay. No, no, it's not. It, it's not a bobblehead. But you know something? It's a perfect. If you if you like Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball Z Kai. Well, I guess not Kai, but you will love your your perfect cell. Um, Funko Pop aesthetic. Okay. So. Okay, so there's your 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 uh, feedback card, and then. Oh, the cheat card. Yeah, and then the card that explains everything you get, which is fine. I think it's a little more environmentally friendly. What? Look at the other ones you can get. <laughs> now, I wonder if they were put in those randomly or everybody got the same guy. Look at that. No, I think those are the three ones that you can get. That could have gotten randomly. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, well. That's okay. I enjoyed my perfect self. So that is the nerd block. What was the theme for this? Uh, Adam, no, no, okay, there we go. The theme for this nerd block that we did not know was Annie May. Annie May, get it? Annie May? Uh, yeah. May 2015 nerd block. The Annie May nerd block. So you got Gundam, Evangelion, um, woo, Attack on Titan, uh, Totoro, Cowboy Bebop, all in all, for, for, your, for your anime manga geeks. Uh, I think this is a pretty good box. Uh, I think they hit the nail on the head on this one. If, hmm? if you fill out their feedback card of what you really don't want, like nerding out about, you could win a one-six scale R2D2 figure. Oh, that's pretty cool. So there you go. Always fill out the feedback cards. Um, again, I thought this was a good value for your ad. Well, okay, for your mainstream anime and manga uh, fan, it's a very good box. Um, also, anime safe for kids. It was, it was very <laughs> safe for kids, you know, nothing too bad. But uh, if any, if any like seven or eight year old is running around with an Attack on Titan backpack like that, and they know what it is, they've got that's that might be a little hard for them to watch. So I'd be impressed, sort of impressed, if if you have a seven or eight year old going, look at my Attack on Titan backpack, and you know, because you normally see these giants just chewing and ripping people apart. Oh, okay. Yeah. So. But it's cartoons. It's cartoons. <laughs> mm. So, mm -hmm. we enjoyed it. If I was going to say, would I buy this or subscribe to this? I would. Off of this box. Off of this Which box. Which is a much bigger improvement than the last one? The two last, we've done? I want... Have we done two? Or is this no, we've done two we've, others. We've had the one with Simon Pegg. Oh, uh, that's right. And then, and then the, the, the one with uh, Kevin, Kevin Smith. Smith book. Yeah. There was no book in this one. There's no, there's a uh, manga book. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, well I don't count that as like. But it's not written by Kevin Smith. Well, I don't. I don't. Yeah. So all right, uh, I give it a thumbs up. Um, so you would say they are 
getting better as you go. Well, again, this is geared more towards my interest. Well, yes, so exactly. I, so, but, 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 okay, but again, since this is geared towards my interest, yeah, I'd be like, ooh. So the question is going to be, next month's yes. nerd block is going to be, you know, completely different. Yes. I can't remember what it's going to be. Um, eh, we'll figure it out. I think it was going to be, I think, I think it's going to be cyber. So it's going to be robots or something. So, or I might be getting my subscription boxes mixed up. Yeah, we'll figure it out. So, all right. So, uh, May 2015 Nerd Block. Thank you. Good going. Appreciate it. It was very good. Uh, we look forward to your next one because for some reason I still have a subscription. I guess I'm being Because you have a hard time canceling things. I know. Sort of like your uh, Xbox <laughs> uh, account. Uh, what is it? Xbox Online? Yeah. Okay, that's it for this month. <laughs> we'll talk to you later. <laughs> Thanks a lot.